Oh, right there, we got a coin. We got a coin. We got a coin. Looks like silver. Right, let's get this up. See what this is. Hey everybody, this is Cliff from Reaching History. Back with another awesome adventure. Uh, on this episode, y'all are going to see me find some more explosive, explosive finds. Um, this is the first time you've been watching Rich in History. You like what you see in my videos. Hey, if y'all don't care, hit that like and subscribe button and help Rich in History out. I would appreciate it. I'm not going to hold you up very long. We're going to get right on into the digging. And you're going to see some pretty awesome stuff right here on the first few holes. I'll see y'all here in just a minute. All right, y'all, I'm back up here where I found the uh, Hotchkiss shell. I got up in here, I already got a signal, and I uh, just dug it up. And it looks like it's a uh, fired Spencer bullet. That's a good sign. That's a first signal, and I'm gonna keep on looking around. All right, y'all, I got a 92 reading right here. Pretty strong, too. Reading 92. So far, I haven't found any signs of anybody being up here except for a drop musket ball. I've been looking for buttons or just some type of sign that somebody was walking around. All right, we got it out. Let's get a pinpointer on it. Oh, right there, we got a coin. We got a coin. We got a coin. Looks like silver. Right, let's get this up. See what this is. Definitely a silver coin. Uh oh, y'all. We got a. We got an 1891 Seated Liberty. Look at that. Look at that. Ain't that beautiful? <laughs> well, there was definitely somebody here in 1891. Uh, oh, good Lord. Never would have thought that. That is so killer. We're going to keep on looking around, see if we find something else. That's pretty awesome. I'll see y'all in a minute. All right, y'all. I'm still coming up this ridge. I got a pretty good sizable reading right here. It's a... Uh, reading up to 80 83 let's get the dirt off of it and see what it is hmm. a lot of roots let's get these roots up we might get to it Getting right up on it right here. I'm gonna turn this shovel around. Should have, I had to buy another shovel. I'm still working on putting a handle in my other one. I got one coming in the mail, I don't know when. But for our type of soil where I live at, yeah, this is just about the only thing you can use is one of these army shovels. So, around so hard, I see iron. I see iron right there. Don't know what it is yet. Let's get some of this dirt off of it. Goodness, man. I'm telling you. Looks like another shell. Oh my goodness. Can y'all see that right there? That looks like an artillery shell. Sure, so I got my fingers crossed. <laughs> oh, I've been here about two hours. Oh Lord. Come on, baby. Come on. It is a shell. I'm almost a pot. I am not believing this. His artillery shell looks like a looks like the nose of a Hotchkiss. Another Hotchkiss shell. Unbelievable. Oh man. Let's get away from it. 
Ah, it is. There it is. It's the nose of another Hotchkiss shell. Look at that. Oh my God. And it's still got the, still got the fuse in it. <laughs> oh Lord, that's amazing. That's number two for this hillside. That is absolutely incredible. Cannot believe it. <laughs> I am loving it. There's gotta be more here. I'm gonna see if I can find a base cup to this. It's here somewhere. We're gonna check the hole real quick. Okay, it may still be down in there. All right. Got the nose section out. Now see if the sabot is down in the bottom of this hole. <laughs> it's right there. It's back this way. Whatever it is. Let's try it with a pin pointer. It's saying that there is still something down in there. All right, let's run the detector out. There's something in there. And I believe it's the Sabbath to this shell, and I'm gonna let y'all watch this. It's just down in there deeper. It's amazing. I haven't hit it yet. Get some of this dirt out. Right there, just saying it's right here. I'm down about a foot. Go back this way. I not hear anything yet. I haven't seen any sign of anything. But there's something down in there. All right, I'm gonna get back with y'all. All right, y'all, I'm still in this hole where I found this Hotchkiss nose. And I think I've got the base cup to the shell back here, the back side of the hole. And I'm gonna dig it out. It, it definitely looks like it. Of course, it could be another artillery shell. I think it's the base to the shell. Yeah, I see it. I'm going to take some of this dirt out to get to it. Y'all just don't know how big of a hole I've got here. <laughs> Alright, let's get some of this dirt off of it. I see it right there. Right there's the base. My knees are about numb from sitting here so long. This could be another shell laying down in this hole. I don't think it is. I think it's just the base this shell. I'm going to watch it together. Oh, there it is. And that's exactly what it is, y'all. It is the base cup to that shell. <laughs> what about that? Ain't that crazy? Oh my goodness. <laughs> it's going to be another amazing day. <laughs> I'm going to keep looking around and I'll see y'all in a little while. Y'all still in this same hole. I want y'all to look right here. I just dug a piece of the lead off of the sabot right there. <laughs> uh, ain't that crazy? Now the same hole. Just gonna keep on looking right here and see if I can find some more lead. I'll see y'all in a minute. All right, y'all. I was walking up the, this uh, little holler I'm in. I got a big reading right here. It's a solid 85. I'm right down below where I found that artillery shell. Sounds really good. What we got here. Could be something good. Got a lot of root. I see if we cut this root. There we go. This could be junk. Let's get this broke out of the way. Could be something really good. 
At least I'm hoping for it. Get these roots out of the way and we can get to digging. We got rocks. I mean, this stuff is like a freaking nightmare. Everywhere you put your shovel in the ground, rocks. Try it again. Sounds really good. We'll put a pin pointer on it. All right, it's in there. All right, let's try to turn this shovel over. It'd be great if this is another shell. I'm not going to complain if it's just a piece of one. Won't be nothing yet. I see some iron. Right there. I don't know what that is. It's going to get back this way. Man, that's hard stuff. I don't think it's a scale. There it is. It's a band. I don't know what that is. I don't know if that's part of a shell or... It's like a small barrel band. It could be off a base cup, off of a uh, Borman or something. Borman shell, but we're gonna keep it. Uh, we'll just keep moving around, see what else we can find. Y'all, I got a... 84 signal right here. I knocked the roots and stuff off the top of it. Got this rock. It's a rough place up in here. Okay, we got it out. Reading a solid 83 or 84. It's a pinpoint. There it is. We got a musket ball. It's like a 58 caliber round ball right there. We're gonna keep on looking around. It's a good find right there. All right, y'all. I got a 84 to 85 signal right here. Get some of these weeds out of my way. See what we got. Pretty rough ground. It's reading 87 now. Down in there. Been digging. Been digging several fired bullets. Right, let's pinpoint this thing. See, it's right down in the middle. All right. I'm going to turn this into a regular shovel real quick. And we're going to see what this is. Right. Try this pin pointer. There it is. Got another fired bullet. Let's cut this pin pointer off. Man, these things are hacked up. Let me wipe this off. Got another fired Spencer. Right there. Spencer bullet, Civil War. Just gonna keep on looking around. I got a reading right here. It goes all the way up into 80, but it sounds iron. We're still right here on the side of this ridge. Just can't ever tell it could be uh, artillery shrapnel or anything. Alright, let's take a detector and run it back over it. It's getting strong. 
385 now. Whew. Could it be another shell? It'd be amazing. I have found two in a day, but. <laughs> Be crazy if this was another artillery shell down in here. Uh. Alright, let's take a detector and run it over. It is reading a solid 85, y'all. <laughs> oh, bear with me. Oh, get these roots out of the grill. What? Come on, come on. I hate to use a shovel like this, but where I'm at, it's about the best. So let's try the pimp on We're getting close. Whatever it is. I'm a little out of breath. <laughs> it's gonna be another one of them days. Alright. Y'all bear with me. Let's see what this is. Dang it. Let's run a detector over it again. It's really loud. Let me get on up here. I'm gonna get right over this so y'all can see this. Nothing. I don't see nothing. Let's get a pimp on her down in there. We are right on top of it. It is probably less than two inches under that dirt. I'm going to be real careful. Don't see nothing yet. Rock down in there. Oh, I see it. I see lead. I got, I got another shell right here, y'all. I see a lead something. I'll be careful. Get over this way. Could be another Hotchkiss shell. I swore I seen something flash white. right there <laughs> it's amazing amazing never what I thought so much dirt this be crazy if it's another artillery shell I see iron right there and I see a little bit of lead be real careful. I'm gonna pop some of the dirt off of it. I see iron right there. I see looks like a lead right there. I'm almost positive it's another shell. Let's go back a little bit. I got a root right here in the way. Let me get that out. Let's get some of this overburden off of it God. I got a root right here it's stopping me uh, all right let me get some of this dirt off of it all right I know y'all can't see it but I I see something round right here and I see white like lead let's say it's gonna be another artillery shell roots out I am not believing this I'm not believing it it is it looks to be another shell oh lord Get some of this dirt right here beside it out of the way I just don't know which way it's going it looks like one 
looks like another shell. Looks like it's going back this way. Hey, uh, never. <laughs> I'm loving this. Look at I'm right beside it. Right over here. Let's see what we got. Definitely see another projectile right there. It's definitely gonna be another shell. Looks like a Hotka shell. The ground broke out around it. Do y'all see that down in there? I do. Right there. That is definitely an artillery shell. Oh my lord. <laughs> I gotta relish this just for a second. Whew, that's a lot of hard digging. Alright, right here beside it. See if we can pop it. Oh, we got it. We got another hot shell. Look at that. Got the intact fuse. Holy mackerel. Holy mackerel. <laughs> oh lord. Oh, that's three Hotchkiss shells off of this ridge so far. That's number two for today. It's still got the fuse in it. Y'all see it right there? That's amazing. Oh my Lord, I am not believing this. I'm gonna keep looking around, see if I can find another one. Oh, Y'all just don't know how great this is. It was almost, I'm gonna say elbow deep with my fingers sticking out, so Probably about 14 inches. Another Hotchkiss shell. Oh man. <laughs> I love it. I'll see y'all after a while. All right, y'all. I'm out of the woods. I'm going to do a little roundup real quick. Had an incredible day again. Um, I got several shotgun holes and deer slugs out of there today. I call them deer slugs. They're just deer shells, the brass parts you can see right there. Several 12 gauge shotgun shells. Um, I did find a an iron rivet up in there too found several just little pieces of iron here's a little iron wedge i found Whew. here's the bullets we got some more civil war bullets today there went one <laughs> we'll get that here in a minute there's a uh, fired spencer bullet i'm thinking this is a fired burn side this is a muzzleloader shell or a bullet that's lead. It's not Civil War. That's probably uh, 1930s or 40s. I did find one dropped 58 caliber musket ball up in there today. That was uh, kind of odd. And this one right here that rode off was a uh, Spencer bullet. You can see where it sat down in the brass casing right there. I also found this beautiful 1891 Seated Liberty Dime up in there today beautiful coin oh my lord y'all second hunt i got two hotchkiss shells out there today i got one right here that's whole still has the brass fuse you can see where it hid in the side of the hill up there it's got the lead sabot and all on it still loaded here's the nose section to another hotchkiss shell still got the brass fuse in it inside that same hole i got the uh the base cup and a piece of the uh, lead sabot that went around it. I checked the hole real good. That was all of it. And then I've got this uh, iron ring right here. Not sure on this one yet, but uh, it was a great hunt. Gonna come revisit this place again. This is just the beginning. It was another incredible hunt and I'm hoping for a lot more in the future. Until next time, I'll see y'all again. Thanks for watching.